In this video, I'm going to teach you how you can integrate the sine of 2x. So we have our integral there, and we're doing this with respect to x currently. However, we need to make some substitution that makes this integral a lot easier. And the appropriate thing to choose for your substitution is to let u equals 2x. And by doing this, you're getting rid of x, and you, when you take the derivative of this, you're going to get a simple constant that isn't going to introduce any other variables. So we take the derivative and we find du dx equals two. We can then rearrange this to get dx equals, and so that simply gives dx equals du over two. We've now got everything that we need to change this integral from being in x to in u. And this will give us something much nicer to integrate. So we replace this 2x with u, and we replace dx with this expression du over 2. So I'm just going to do that substitution on the next line. I've not done anything else other than just substituting the u here and replacing dx with our rearranged uh, version of the derivative. So we made this substitution here. You'll notice that you've got a factor of 2 here on the bottom, so that's like multiplying by a half. So we can actually take that out as a factor, and that's not going to affect our integration because multiplying by constants doesn't affect an integration. So you can take that outside of the integral. So we've got a much nicer integral, and we're doing this du with respect to u. And so you can remember that the integral of sine is simply minus cosine plus your constant. And so if we do that, we get that the integral of this is simply minus, that comes from there, that minus there, the cosine of u plus c. We don't want an integration in terms of u. That's not very helpful. So we have to look back to the beginning and say we said that u equals 2x. So you can replace this u with 2x. That gives us this answer here. And that is actually our final answer. So we can say that the integral of sine 2x is simply equal to minus a half the cosine 2x plus c. So that is now your final answer. You can now integrate sine 2x. Hope that this video was helpful to you. And finally, thank you very much for watching.